आई एम हर्ष खतकड़े आई एम फ्रॉम मुंबई एंड आई एम अ कंप्यूटर साइंस ग्रेजुएट फ्रॉम यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ मुंबई एंड आई गॉट एन ग्रेट आई गॉट ग्रेट अपॉर्चुनिटी फ्रॉम क्यू एट टू इंटर्न एज अ सॉफ्टवेयर इंजीनियर इन पैकेट एट यूनिकॉन स्टार्टअप फॉर स्पिन सो स्पिन इज बेसिकली फुल स्टैक कार बाइक एंड सेलिंग प्लेटफॉर्म माई इन एवरी इंजीनियर फोर्थ एंड फोर्थ ईयर एंड फाइनल ईयर एवरी वन कीप सर्चिंग फॉर इंटर्नशिप्स एंड एफ and you know 2022 21 was kind of an covid era and it was so kind of difficult to get internships or tra- uh, get attention of recruiters to just just get an interview or something. so i was just scrolling through linkedin so, uh, one day and i guess i saw your post of i guess i was following you on linkedin so i saw this platform and uh, i just dis- i decided to like uh, register myself on it to Uh, because I was looking for internships and jobs, so mm-hmm. I registered. I registered on Qed and I applied for like ten fifteen. Uh, and surprisingly, I got reply from like uh, out of ten fifteen, I got like seven to eight responses. Mm-hmm. Uh, and uh, like test links from them and recruiters called me. So I gave like four to five tests, and uh, Spinny was the one that uh, I selected uh, because it was uh, even the company was great and they were offering some. Uh, Yeah, I mean the applying process it was very, very seem, very seemingly easy. Like on other platforms, like you have to keep filling this form, always uh, experience over there, or her bar, her bar, mail, cheese, same cheese, got there. But in Qed, you just make a profile once and just keep uh, apply on, and it just sends your profile. So that was very easy. So in this way, like I usually ten to twelve days, I apply. Not so, but other platforms, but then her, her is me, all other form, bro, and then. थोड़ा लेजीनेस की वजह से पीपल जस्ट अटेंड टू स्पेक सो दैट वॉज वन ऑफ द गुड थिंग एंड आई से दैट दिस टाइप एंड ऑफ दी सी टी सी एक्सपेक्टेशन आर ऑलवेज करेक्ट वॉट इट इज शोड ऑन प्लेटफॉर्म बिकॉज ऑन लिंकड इन एज वेल पीपल जनरली शो सम ह्यूज नंबर एंड वेन दे एक्चुअली कॉल फॉर द टेस्टिंग दे जस्ट से दैट वी आर गोइंग टू टू गिव यू दिस नंबर सो आई डोंट थिंक आई थिंक ट्रांसपेरेंसी वॉज वेरी क्लियर So first thing I would like to tell that uh, like there is this stereotype in India like it's not possible for tier three uh, college students to get good internships and everything. So I would say that it's uh, it used to be there, but I don't think it exists anymore. Like even because I belong to tier three college and uh, I track uh, like pretty good internships and I'm working with like a tier two tier one college student. Keep your CS fundamentals ready, like. Uh, The problem is that, like the problem, uh, what I feel is, people just start uh, before. Like there are some fundamentals in CS, like about DBMS and OS, and these are some basic fundamentals. Instead of studying these fundamentals, people just uh, like jump on, like before even learning React, they start doing like uh, next JS and everything. So that's not going to help. You have to stick to the fundamentals, and after that, uh, you have to plan the learning. So that's one of the things. I feel is important. Like keep DSA or your uh, any one framework. Uh, like stick to a framework and uh, stick to no- normal DSA questions and computer science fundamentals. Don't just jump on to something uh, that's not going to help you in interviews. Because no one's directly going to ask you that hey, write some code in next year in an interview. Obviously, they are going to focus on LLD and your uh, CS fundamentals. Because like even I used to do a lot of CP because I didn't have any developer experience in college. But uh, I guess DSA is important. But even learning a framework, like sticking to one framework, is uh, enough. Mm-hmm. I guess what people do is they uh, they learn like five to six frameworks and this and Android development and web development. But I don't think that's important. Just stick to stick to one thing and. That would suffice your basic internship and placement criteria. First of all, your very first round is your uh, basic ES round. So I would say that I'll do some easy or medium grade four questions like top fifty or anything, and keep those in hand. And after that, after you clear ES round, there's this uh, LLD round or uh, CS fundamentals round. So the, the subjects you study in your third and fourth year are kind of important, which students tend to neglect. Like people generally don't study OS and computer yeah. architecture for this everything, and that's one of the things that uh, led me to lose uh, one or two offers from other companies as well because I didn't study OS. And uh, so keep your uh, basics ready and uh, don't expect uh, 
that interview interviewer will ask any kind of like m- m- most difficult questions even they are here to hire you i will take you to uh, interview us uh, yeah i actually i have always recommended you it like two to three like not two to three like many of my juniors uh, asked that uh, hey, where did you get this good interns with them such good in your past startup and everything so i have always recommended i just send them to a dot that link the is apply kar do is perform karo and just keep applying you will really get some good results from it